So the company Neo reached out to me and asked if I wanted to re review the uh, Tua box. Uh, what it is, is a controller for creators who use uh, software like Adobe Photoshop, Lightroom, uh, Premiere Pro. And what it is, is a box really, uh, like a shortcut to all the uh, keys that you use uh, within them software. So uh, the process of uh, editing becomes easier and quicker. So what I'm going to do first, I'm just going to unbox this. So what you get in the box here, um, you'll get a note here, like an instructions, just how to set up the uh, tour box. And uh, when you put it in, you've got to go to a website, tourbox.com, uh, to download the version for your computer. Um, all the instructions are there for you to do that. Um, also within the box is a quick start guide in uh, different languages. You get another little booklet, safety instructions for the tour box. Now just remove this top part here. And in this bag here, is the actual tour box now it's it's not really heavy but it's a decent wave weight you're not you know it's not going to slip off or anything it's going to stay in place so uh yeah you have all these controllers here and you are able to um, custom program each key uh to whatever you want to use say if you've got the four points here um, I'd probably program the exposure there, the highlights there, uh, the whites there. If so, if you if you know what I mean, and then you can control with this joggle here um, the exposure and all that, rather than using your mouse. And you're probably going to get a more accurate sort of uh, reading, aren't you, than with your hand anyway, if you know what I mean. So yeah, that's a solid little box. Um, I don't know what. It's like plastic, but not cheap plastic. It's pretty heavy sort of thing. Um, and you got a plug in the back here for the USB that goes straight into your PC. So that's the uh, control box. And over here, in this little bag here, you've got the, uh, I think it's the, yeah, it's the USB cable. Um, Good quality one as well, it's not a cheapish one. Um, and it's got pretty good length on it so you can uh, run it from your uh, desk down to your computer. So it's not like a short lead. So uh, yeah, that's it. Um, that's what you get in the box. Uh, so we'll go upstairs now and uh, set it into the uh, computer and probably go on to Lightroom and uh, see how it works. Right, so what you need to do now is go on to the uh, Tour Box website um, and look for the latest version for your PC. You can also download Mac or PC, whatever. So yeah, just, uh, just go down and uh, look what the latest firmware and download onto your computer. When the software is uh, downloaded, don't forget you need to connect the tour box to the uh, computer via the uh, USB cable supplied. Once the software is uploaded, you can just go straight onto the tour box panel and uh, within this panel here, you'll be able to, um, well, set it up the way you wanna set it up. Um, Right, so I've changed the four keys here. I've got the exposures there. Um, the whites, I'll probably change to a shadow. Um, 
if I can see it somewhere. We'll exposure contrast shadows there. I'm gonna put that there. Okay, so I've got my exposure. I've got my shadows there. I've got my contrast there. And I'll probably change the blacks to, let's see what we got here. So that's what you do, you just double click on it and then you'll come up to the, uh, what you want over here. So, um, okay, detail, I think I'll use the sharpening amount there. So what you see there, I've programmed the exposure, the shadows, the contrast, and the sharpening detail over there. Okay then, so now I'm in Lightroom, and uh, so what I've got here, I pr I'll press this, that's my exposure, and uh, you can see there what it's doing. Um, if I press on this one, I adjust the shadows there. Press this one, I can adjust the contrast of the image, like so. And this will show me how I sharpen. So, so that's basically it. What you do with a toolbox here is on the interface, um, if I can go into it now, over here, you can change all these bits over here to whatever suits you like i put in this like i put here in the four points here are the ones that i use a lot like the exposure shadows contrast contrast the sharpening over there but you can just adjust it to whatever you like so uh, so yeah so everything's in one hand and uh, works that way so uh, it takes a bit of time getting used to but um You'll get the hang of it pretty quickly uh, when you know where everything is on the uh, little toolbox here. So my uh, final thoughts on the uh, toolbox. Um, what I like about this, uh, something similar to this came out um, a couple of years ago called the Loop Deck. Uh, not that I ever had one, but everyone was complaining that it was a, a bit big and far too many buttons on it. But I think what's good about this is it's so small uh, that all the controls are here in your hand. So there are three assignable dials on it, uh, all with a click function. Uh, there are 11 buttons on it uh, in seven different sizes and they're all user assignable, means you can program each uh, button to uh, whatever you want. Um, so I said, like I said before, really good quality. Uh, it's not going to slip anywhere on the desk. It just stays on the desk. Um, now the price of this is, I think it's only around £150, maybe a bit more. I'm not too sure. If you are interested, uh, I'll leave a link uh, below for you to get the tour box. But if you're into video editing, you can use it on Adobe Premiere Pro. Uh, Photoshop and Lightroom and other software uh, packages you can use the loop not the loop duck the tour box for so yeah um, it saves time when editing just because everything's to hand and you don't have to mess about with the mouse at all and another thing if you're if you're going away a lot and you do a lot of editing on the laptop um, this would be brilliant for traveling um, just to save some time. So there you go, that's my little uh, review on the tour box. Um, I've got nothing bad to say about it actually. Um, it's pretty straightforward. Uh, on the panel, you just tap everything into whatever you want over there and there you go. And uh, I think it takes a bit of time to get used to, but once you know where everything is on the little box, um, it'll just be like using a mouse with your fingers, you'll know where everything is. So yeah, um, like I said, I'll leave the link below if you're interested. And that's it for my uh, review of the tour box. Thanks for watching. Please do subscribe 
and until next time, bye. Thank you.